October 25th, 2003. The first time that I ever became the WAW champion. And tonight, I'm gonna repeat that. I'm going out there and I'm gonna win the strap. But this time, I'm gonna do it the right way. In an absolute victory. Saying, I'm gonna make you pin, I'm gonna make you tap, and then, I'm gonna prove to everybody, including Sin, why I deserve to be in the Hall of Fame. I don't know why you bug me with this stupid promo. One, you don't deserve a promo from the WAW champion. And two, we went all through this before. It started with Gino, Di Gino Diomedes. It went on to Annihilation YP team and for and his whole team. Then it went on to Todd Swoop with Sky. Tonight is no different, that fool. Tonight, the rain is saying it's not gonna change because I'm walking out WAW champion. The following contest is your main event. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, it is main event time. Absolute victory for the WAW Championship. And here comes the special guest referee. It is WAW Hall of Famer, the War Machine Sin. And you gotta wonder which side he's gonna be on here tonight. He's getting cheers from the fans, but hey, we're, uh, we're no big time. We don't have the, uh, the live video feed. Our fans have not even seen that Sin and Christian Sane were shaking hands backstage earlier tonight. So you're gonna wonder just how impartial our special guest referee is gonna be. But let's take it down to the introduction of the number one contender. Entry first is your challenger, the Cup Coast champion, hailing from Weeds, New Mexico. Weeds! It's Mr. W-A-W. And people light up here tonight, here at Hellbound 2007, as Mr. WAWFO enters for his WAW Championship match here tonight at Hellbound. Absolute victory. The fans light up. Can Mr. WAW do it? The first time he ever won the gold, it was at Hellbound. Can he do it again here tonight? We will soon find out. The fans lighting up for Mr. WAW. Christian Zane will look to continue the reign of Zane. Can he do it against Mr. W.A.W.? Or will Christian Zane's reign come to an end here tonight? The champion hoists up the gold. He enters absolute victory. And our main event of the first Hellbound in three years is just moments from getting underway.
Here we go, absolute victory for the WIW Championship. Christian Sane, the champion. FO, the challenger. Sin, the special referee. Which way is Sin gonna go? Is he gonna call it down the middle? Is he gonna help Sane retain the gold? Is he gonna help FO win the gold? We don't know the, the outcome of this Hellbound main event has never been more up in the air as it just became when our cameras caught sitting Christian Sane shaking hands backstage prior to this contest. I don't like where things could be heading if that handshake means what it could be. Sin wants a clean start. He breaks up the, uh, the lockup in the corner. He wants a clean start to this absolute victory. There are no rules other than you must get a pinfall and a submission. It is no disqualifications and it is pinfalls count anywhere. But absolute victory is more about the wrestling side of it. Because I don't expect too much hardcore nature out of these two. While it may be hellbound, while it may be all about the violence here tonight, and this one, it's about the, the wrestling between Christian Sane and Effa. Sane taking off the shirt, coming back into the ring. Both men circling around the canvas. Test of strength here. Sane comes in with the shoulder. Effo backing him into the ropes. Powers him down. Monkey flips him over. We got both men's feet locked. Sane checks the shoulders, nothing happening there. No pinfall. Effo brought up onto his feet. Sane takes Effo. Monkey flips him over. Sane comes over the top. Effo brings it back on. Sane backing up Effo into the ropes. Oh, he stomps on the foot. Irish whip on Effo. Sends him off the ropes. Sunset flip and Sane drops down. We get a cover. We only get one. We get another cover. We get. And we get one once again. We get another cover. We get two. Another cover. And once again, two. Four straight falls, two on each of them. Effo now with the backslide, he's going for it. We're gonna cover, we're gonna count, and we only get two. And Christian Zane heads to the outside. He wants a timeout. Christian Sane now enters back into the ring. Kick to the midsection of Effo. Driving him head first right into the top turnbuckle. Oh, European uppercut. And another one. That's two European uppercuts out of the champion. Irish whip reversed by Effo. Sends the champion in. Effo comes charging. Gets a boot in the face from Christian Sane. Sane now up on the ropes. Here comes Effo. Going after Sane. Could it be a suplex out of the corner? Sane hammering away at the ribs and kidneys. What do we got here? Sunset flip bomb. Could it be? No. Effo holds him in the corner, and he's going for 10 punches here. He's up to five. Calling for number 10 here. The F and the O, and he hits it there. Same dropping down in the corner. After 10 punches, we usually take a trip to Bismarck. Could it be? Effo charging up. Here he comes. Nobody home for the Bismarck. Effo hits out of the corner. Landing back first on the mat. Oh, and Effo gets driven in. Knee first into the ring post. One more time from the WAW champion, Christian Zane. Sin can plead with both men all he wants, asking what they're doing, why they're doing it, and he can try and say not to do it, but ultimately Sin has no power to disqualify anybody. He's here to be impartial, and he is here to count a three, but now Christian Sin going for a pile driver. Those things are banned here in WAW. Effo now counters it, and slick shots Christian Sin into the trick-or-treat debris left over from the WAW Team Championship match. Effo calling for the big top drop, says he's gonna go for the pin early. He's got Sane up to the no. Christian Sane breaks the eyes of Effo and heads back into the ring. Very smart by the WAW Champion.
Here comes Effo charging after the champ. Oh! Drop kick to the knee of Effo, and Effo goes down. Oh, same drop down right across the knee of Effo, draping that leg over the bottom rope. Pushing off and dropping down once again. That's twice. Christian Sane going to work on the, the left knee of Effo, trying to inflict some damage on his challenger. Oh, head first once again, right into the top turnbuckle. And Christian Sane rips the top turnbuckle off in the front left corner, exposing the steel. Sin can't do anything about it. He can reprimand Sane, but in the end, oh, Effo hits back first. In the end, Sane can do what he wants. Sane charges. Oh, he hits a knee right into the exposed steel. Oh, and Effo drops underneath. Thought he went for a drop kick, but instead he's got a single leg grab, and he's got Sane in it. This could be a submission. If Sane gives it up, this could be all. Sane pulling for the outside, and he gets out to the floor. There's no rope breaks in this one. Effo tries for the baseball slide, and Christian Sane makes him pay by slamming that knee right into the ring apron, and again. This time looked like it was more the calf. Oh, and Sane takes the WAW Championship belt right to the back of the kneecap of Effo, taking him down to the floor. Sane now has Effo in the ring and flipping over the top rope. Sane goes for the cover, we get a count, and we only get two as Effo gets a shoulder up. As we've said, it is a pinfall and a submission to win. Neither man have achieved either thus far. Both men have gone for many near falls. And wait a second, what's this? Sane is locked on the sharpshooter. He's got the sharpshooter on Effo, and Sin reluctantly is asking Effo if he wants to give it up. What an insult it would be if Christian Sane uses the sharpshooter to defeat Effo in the submission portion of this match. Effo reversing, he's got the legs locked, he's pulling back, Effo's got a modified sharpshooter on here. Will Christian Sane tap out? Yes he does! Christian Sane taps out, and that's the end of that one there. Effo's got a submission, now all he has to do is get a pinfall, and this one's over. Effo's got to get a pin, this piece of trash is down too. Submission, he needs a pin and a submission. Ring announcer getting a little overzealous there. Uh, he read the rules and went to announce Effo was the winner. Hey, it's hell about maybe he's had a few cocktails during the intermission. Who knows? Either way, Effo has not yet won this contest. He has a submission. Therefore, all he needs is a pinfall, and the WAW Championship is his. Christian Sane needs a submission. Oh, and he needs a pinfall. Oh, DDT, right on the ring apron. Effo planted head first, right into the apron. Sane rolling Effo over. Going for the cover, we get a count, and we only get two. Sane has Effo in a reverse chin lock now, locked in tight. Effo trying to fight out and as his face is being gouged, he's being pulled back. Effo will not give it up. He's up. Elbows to the midsection of Christian Sane. Three times the charm. Off the ropes. Oh, and he gets caught with a knee right into the stomach. Oh, inverted backbreaker there by Christian Sam. We get cover with a count. We only get two. Oh, yeah. 
Sane now heading to the outside, and he is heading up to the top rope. Christian Sane, no stranger to the high rent district, and he gets stopped by Epo. Epo now has Sane. Sane trying to fight out of it. Epo's got Sane. What are we gonna have here? Suplex out of the corner. And both men hit hard. Epo's down, Sane is down. Both men have unlimited time to get back up to their feet. We're gonna cover, and we only get two. Sin calls for the rope break, and then he smacks Christian Sane, telling him there's no rope break. And I guess Sin can do whatever he wants. He can call for a rope break, and then he can say there are no rope breaks. There are none by the virtue of the rules of this contest. Epo trying for the big top drop. Oh, and he gets sent in head first, right into the exposed steel. And Saint's gonna triangle choke through the ropes on Epo. This is 100% legal. And Epo taps out. We're even on a submission apiece. Each man now needs a pinfall to win the WAW Championship. So essentially, it's sudden death time. Next fall wins. Both men need a pin. Who's gonna get that pin first? It's been hotly contested so far. And it's only gonna get hotter from here. It's Hellbound, it's a WAW Championship. It's a two and a half. Epo getting a shoulder up after nearly being choked out in the triangle choke. Christian Sane now bringing a chair into the ring. This is 100% legal. And Sin takes the chair away from Christian Sane. He's stopping him from using chairs. What the hell were they shaking hands about earlier? Epo takes the chair from Sin. And we got dueling chairs here. Epo and Christian Sane. Oh, we get a boot to the midsection. Wait a second. Epo's got Sane. Zipper down across the chair. We get a cover. We get a count. And we only get two. Narrowly escaping defeat there was Christian Sane by putting his shoulder up at the last moment. What is Epo setting up here? Epo oh, says he's gonna put Sane through those chairs. He's got him set up. Oh, a knee right to the face by Sane. Sends him off the rope. No way. Oh, spine buster. Spine buster into those chairs. We get a cover. We get two. And we know we don't get three. Thought for sure Christian Sane had it won there, but it was not to be. Sane has the chair continued. Oh, he throws it right in the head of Epo. Epo tried to block it, it didn't help him there. Now the chair positioned in the corner. Here comes Sane. Oh, a drop kick into the chair. Epo gets steel right into his face. Christian Sane pulling out the challenger, goes for the cover. And oh, we almost get three once again. But Epo gets a shoulder up. Sane brings Epo over to the corner, hoisting him up, puts him up on the top rope. Epo hits Sane, hits him again, and again, and Christian Sane falls out of the corner. Epo on the ropes, on the middle rope, flying cross body, we're gonna cover, we're gonna count, and we only get two. Countdown! Epo calls for the countdown. He's got Sane up on the ropes. Going for the countdown. Sane fighting out. Oh, rake to the eyes by the WAW champion on Epo. Sane has the chair. 
He's setting up the chair, sitting it out. What does he have in mind for the steel chair? He's got Epo. He's got him up on the shoulders now. Epo ducks. And oh, atomic drop to Christian Saint. Epo sitting Saint down in the chair. Saint sat down. Epo on the middle ropes. What do we got here? Drop kick out of the corner. Drop Saint. Sends him backwards out of the chair. Back flipping out. Cover. We get a count and we only get two. Cyclone! Sin calling, excuse me, Epho calling for the Cyclone. And belly to belly suplex, overhead style. Sin a little out of position there. We're going to cover and we only get two and a half. Sin's been out of position on the last two pinfalls here, taking a little extra time to get to the covers. And it's actually hurt both men. Hurt Epo on the last pin, hits, hurt Sane on the, uh, this current pin. So I guess we're even. Cyclone! Epo calls for the Cyclone, trying for it. Christian Sane went for the lobotomy, nothing happening. He's got him up. And Sane continues to fight the Cyclone. He does not want to take that ride. He's up and he's down. Cyclone DDT by Effa. Cover, and we only get two. Effa's got Sane up, go for the big top drop, no. Sane's down. He goes for the roll up, not happening. Paralyzer by Christian Sane. We get a cover, we get a count, and once again, we only get two. Neither man will give it up here, and Epo does not on this last turn. Numerous near falls here in this contest. Thus far, it has not come to be for either man. Each man has a submission. Each man trying to go for the pin. Food salt, nobody home. I told you he's done with the big top drop. Epo's picking up Tate again, going for that big top drop. Can he land it this time? Yes, he does. Big top drop, he lands it. Could Epo go for the splash here? Epo heading up to the ropes. He could be going for that Epo splash. And wait a second. Sin hits the ropes when Christian Zane shoves him. And Epo gets crouched up on the top. And the bottom lane. This has got to be all. The reign of Zane will continue here if Christian Zane can make it over for the cover. This is pretty academic. Two. And oh no! Epo got a shoulder up. Not to be there for Christian Sane. Oh, Sane shoves Sane. Sane shoves back. We get a cover. We get a count. And we almost had a new WNW champion. And Christian Sane drops Epo with a super kick. We get a cover. We get a count. And we only get two. Zane says he's going for the big top drop, but not to be. We get a lobotomy out of Epo. Epo hits a lobotomy. We get a cover. We get a count. And we almost have a new champion once again. Both men battling back and forth here. This has been a hard battle, and they will not stop. Both men want to walk out of here, the WAW champion. And I don't think there's any length either man will go to. Excuse me, that they won't go to. Wait a second, Sane's got the title. He's up on the shoulders, and big top drop. Sane trying to use the title. He got caught. He got hit with a big top drop. Epo now, heading up to the top rope. Can he hit the splash this time? Will he be able to do it? He's up, he flies, Epo splash. We get a 
cover two, three, and we have a new WAW champion. I don't believe it, ladies and gentlemen. FO wins the WAW championship here tonight at Hellbound 2007. Talking the trash that Christian Sane, telling him the reign of Sane is over. That it, it was just a stain on Sane here tonight. FO, the new WAW champion. It's been a long time coming for Mr. WAW. He has gone through hell and back. The man in the stripes is partially responsible for what Epo has gone through. In fact, in the last year, he's 100% responsible for what Epo's gone through in terms of the hell. He put Epo through hell. He mudsling his career. He put out those political ads. And then Sin made a return telling Epo he wanted him to win the WAW Championship here tonight. And wait a second, what's this? When you gamble on sin, you gamble at all. And Pell, you gamble the title tonight. Can you believe that? There was a play. Wait a second. Sin goes for a slap. Sin's got him. He's got him up. He's got him hoisted. Could it be? And Sinner. Christian Sin goes down on the Sinner. Sin calling for the Tam Fodder. Christian Sane interrupting the celebration and sends him out to take care of the problem. Damn father! Christian Sane lands in the front row. And Epo's celebration of being the new WAW champion can resume without the former champion in the ring. Sin remained impartial. It was questionable whether he would or not. But Sin did the right thing and called the action right down the middle here in Hellbound 2007. And because of that, we have a brand new WAW champion for a third time. Highly speculated to go into the Hall of Fame this year here at WAW, and he wins. Wait a second, what's going on here? The Hellbound music was playing. I thought that just signified the end of the show here. But Moody Star is coming out. She's calling up though to come back to the ring. She's grabbing a mic. What? This isn't in my formats. I don't have this anywhere. We're, I don't have this in my formats. What the hell's going on here? So I'm going to explain to you something I'm going to do tonight. But Sin, I'm waiting on something from you. I'm waiting on a vote from Sin. Yeah, that's it. Here you go. It is official. Tonight I'm held down. Not only is I vote our new WWE champion. He is officially now our 2007 WWE Hall of Fame inductee. What a blockbuster announcement! What a moment here at Hellbound 2007. Our 2007 Hall of Fame inductee is the new WAW Champion FO. It's unanimous. He's got all the votes. And Mr. WAW could now be called Mr. Hall of Famer. How about that? Fellow Hall of Famer, the Jersey Devil, joining FO in the ring. And Epo hoisted up the new WAW champion. I'm at a total loss of what to say here. This is quite a moment here at Hellbound. Everybody calling fans into the ring. The fans clapping. We owe Epo a clap here. Epo is the 2007 Hall of Famer. Give it up for the new WAW champion, ladies and gentlemen. What a night it has been here at Hellbound. We crowned the first Hellbound champion in three years. Joey Staples will tentatively challenge Epo at Doomsday for the WAW Championship. Total Chaos will tentatively go head to head 
with full metal jacket in Doomsday for the WAW Team Championship as Total Chaos won the three-team elimination match. There you see an embrace between two Hall of Famers, Sin and Epo, they've been through hell and back. Good to see that Sin actually stuck by his word. Anyway, getting back on track here, tonight at Hellbound, we saw Total Chaos win that table match. Trick or Treat 5 did not work out for Asylum as FMJ walked away still the WAW Team Champions. And here in our main event, an absolute victory, FO scored the pinfall, scored the submission, and scored the WAW Championship. But his night did not end there as FO was inducted into the WAW Hall of Fame just moments after Sin handed him his vote, the last vote needed, and it made it unanimous. Epo is your 2007 Hall of Famer. Epo sharing a moment with his father. What a moment. Epo's family's here tonight. Epo's friends are here tonight to see the new WAW champion inducted into the Hall of Fame. What a moment. What a night. What a return for Hellbound. The road to Doomsday begins. But tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we were Hellbound.